Hi guys, let's check the breaking news, Chelsea signing one more top player, Man City player moved to Saudi club, PSG player signed with Manchester United. Welcome to Footballist, for the latest football news and transfer updates, please subscribe the channel, if you like the video kindly like and support us. Atlanta goalkeeper Juan Musso is set to become Atletico Madrid's new goalkeeper on a loan deal that includes a mandatory buy option clause. Manchester United have signed 23-year-old Uruguayan midfielder Manuel Ugarte from PSG for €50 million. Euros. Leverkusen defender Jonathan Ta is determined to leave the club this summer or on a free transfer in 2025, with Bayern and Barcelona keeping tabs on the player. Chiesa has expressed his interest to join Liverpool following initial discussions and is fully available for the move. He is excited about the opportunity, and there are no concerns regarding contract negotiations. Juventus are keen for him to depart and have set an asking price of approximately 15 million euros. Neymar's camp has issued a statement refuting recent rumors about his return to Barcelona from Al Hilal calling the reports lies and a tremendous disrespect to both Al Hilal and the player. They emphasize that Neymar is currently under contract with Al Hilal and is content in Riyadh, adding that he will soon be back on the pitch to entertain the fans. Barcelona left-back Marcos Alonso is set to join Celta Vigo with a deal now confirmed. He will be moving on a free transfer, and his contract has been approved. The next step is for Celta Vigo to ensure they have the necessary financial fair play space to complete the signing of the former Barcelona left-back. La Liga have approved Barca's option to register Dani Almo due to Christensen's long-term absence for an injury. Al Nasser submits official bid for Milan Skriniar as new centre-back. Skriniar can leave Paris Saint-Germain in the final days and Al Nasser are leading the race with an official bid. Despite approaches from Italy on loan, PSG prefer the proposal from Saudi as it's for a permanent transfer. Lionel Messi turned down a weekly salary offer from Al Hilal worth between 15 to 20 million euros a year ago, according to Fox Sports Argentina. The total salary, including objectives and bonuses, could have amounted to approximately 900 million euros or even 1 billion euro over the year. Juventus had a productive round of discussions regarding the Tun Cupminers deal. They are optimistic about receiving approval from Atlanta following these talks and are now awaiting the formal decision. The official bid remains unchanged from what was exclusively revealed two weeks ago of 52 million euros. Napoli is no longer insisting on a 130 million euro fee for Victor Osimhen, who is a target for PSG and Chelsea. The club is now eager to sell the striker before the rapidly approaching end of the transfer window. Al Hilal's proposal for Kingsley Coman has already been received by Bayern Munich, and the club is prepared to accept it. The final decision now rests with Coman, as Premier League clubs and Barcelona have also shown concrete interest in recent days. Atletico Madrid is exploring a deal to sign Mateus Nunes on a season-long loan from Manchester City before the transfer window closes. Nunes has not been getting sufficient playing time at City. Arsenal have officially announced the signing of Mikel Marino from Real Sociedad for a fixed fee of €32 million. Euros. The midfielder has signed a long-term contract that will keep him at the club until June 2028. Juventus are aggressively pursuing a deal to sign 24-year-old Jadon Sancho from Manchester United this summer, with ongoing negotiations focused on a loan arrangement. If Manchester United does not cover any of Sancho's £350,000 per week wages, Juventus have alternative targets in mind. A permanent transfer is also being considered, potentially involving a player swap. Sancho has removed all references to Manchester United from his Instagram. Al Hilal have signed 30-year-old Joao Cancelo from Manchester City for €25 million. Euros. The Portuguese international has signed a deal until 2027 in Saudi Arabia. Chelsea making a last-minute move to sign Ivan Toni from Brentford this summer. The clubs are currently in negotiations, personal terms are already agreed. Toni wants a transfer and will not sign a new deal. Brentford need to sell him or he will leave for free. Do you think Ivan Toni will be successful in Chelsea? Share your comments, these are the updates for today and thanks for watching.